Hello, I'm Dr. Sean Cohen and welcome to Laser Assisted Cataract Surgery using the LensX Laser by Alcon Canada. I have no commercial interest in this product and I'm not being paid to produce this video. Using the analogy of a typewriter, I'm going to explain the difference between conventional surgery and laser surgery. Using a typewriter, every word that I type, every letter that I type, immediately produces an effect directly on the product of the paper. I'd like to be able to make changes before I commit to the surgery. Once I type with a word processor, as I type, I can format the text and make corrections. I can fix spelling mistakes, I can change fonts, sizes, I can make changes to my patterns and see the effect that will appear on the paper. And only once I'm fully satisfied do I hit the print button. I'd love to be able to do this in surgery. And we can. Using the Lens X model of a laser, we apply a suction cup to an eye and we move the patterns that we want to set onto the eye, the wound positions, the angles, centration, everything. We can establish it all. But one of the things that a laser can do, that a human can't do, is see things in three dimensions. The laser sees the lens in three dimensions using what we call optical coherence tomography, or OCT. And here you have a side view of the lens where the laser knows its depth and all its cutting parameters in advance. I can't do that looking from above, but the laser can. The laser can also make a cut going in many angles. Here you have, you see the purple line from the surface of the eye, extends downwards, takes a sharp angle, and then comes into the eye. The hand can't do that with a blade. The blade doesn't bend in those angles, but the laser can make sure that the cut is exactly 50% thickness. Only once we're completely satisfied, we then apply this precise pattern, perfectly produced, directly onto the eye in about less than a minute. This is now being produced real time. That's the laser edge to the surface of the lens, that ring there, that removes the capsule of the lens. And then it etches three lines to break the lens into six quadrants. The bubbles form from ca cavitation, we call that, which is basically the protein uh, particles of the lens being broken up. And we have a central core of a ring in the center, which we'll use to, to debulk the lens as well during the surgery. During surgery, we use ultrasound or vacuum to remove the remaining components of the lens, and then we can fold in a new lens. This procedure significantly makes this uh, surgery a lot safer and also reduces the energy required. Now the laser will etch the surface incision patterns finally. Thank you very much for your time and attention. I hope this is very informative for you. Please join me on the web at www.supereyecare.com. Thank you.